What's good everyone, Smile Grove here. Today we are playing Grid. This is my first time playing Grid, and I'm very excited because this is a brand new game since the last game in 2014. So here we go, this is the opening screen. You have career mode, multiplayer, free play, player profile, your store, and your options in the game. It's pretty simple. We're gonna start off in career mode. As you can see here, there is a ton of stuff in career mode. There is a ton of tracks. There's obviously going to be a ton of cars. Just a lot of content and a lot of stuff that um, we can go through and play. So I'm going to start it off in touring just to uh, kick it off and see what this game is like. And if you want to see more videos like this, please like and subscribe to this channel. So we have a Ford Focus TC2. That's the first car we're optioned at. We have a Subaru WRX STI TC2 an Audi RS3 LMS and a Volkswagen Golf GTI TCR it looks like the Subaru has the best power to weight ratio so I'm gonna go ahead and go with that this is an interesting loading screen alright so we see what the track looks like we see a whole bunch of player cards those are gonna be our opponents I'm assuming it's nice to have this on the loading screen honestly it's nice to uh, view something rather than just a blank black screen while the game is loading and getting ready but it clearly takes a long time it looks like we might get through every uh, opponent on the grid here as we load alright so here's the tuning options in the game it's pretty minimal you have gear ratio springs dampers anti-roll bars and brake bias I'll probably put the springs up a little bit firmer dampers slightly firmer again um, the anti-roll bars I'll probably leave alone and brake bias I'll probably just leave it as it is like I said I haven't played this game this is my first time so I just want to see what the car is like on track and uh, see how it handles and we'll go from there oh there's a black loading screen so disregard what I said before does have a black loading screen. The graphics are really good. Alright, so those are our multiple camera angles. I'm gonna go with cockpit view. I like to have the most realistic view that I can have in a car when uh, driving. A lot of tire squeal in this car. I like the sound. The sound of this game is really good. I must say, honestly, Codemasters, they put out great racing games. Grid, F1, um, they do the World Rally games, or the dirt games don't quote me on that I don't know off the top of my head probably should look it up before I speak but anyway Codemasters does put out a lot of great racing games I can tell you already from just this brief amount of driving here that this is not a sim alright we're gonna be first place on the grid pole position our first time out I'm pretty happy with that I mean I can't get better well I can improve time but not positions so anyway um it's not a full sim it's maybe a simcade I, I guess I'll, I'll go with simcade it drives nice Oh wow, look at this. This is interesting. So 
so I wonder if those player cards are going to stay on the cars or if they're going to go away and I'll just see the cars. I hope they're going to go away. It looks like from my left mirror they do go away, which is a great thing because I would not want to see that while driving around the track. All right, Audi. Can I take you on the inside? Ooh. A little scrappy there. A little scrappy. Oh, check that out. It gives you a little drafting bonus. Wow, there's a ton of little bonuses you get. So I guess, based on your driving, which is a good thing, you'll get little bonus points, and that'll help you improve maybe your car or maybe just you know how you level up in the game oh wow really missed the braking zone there way too late on the brakes well the graphics are, are pretty nice look look at the left look at the uh, the driver's window. The, yeah, the driver's side window. Look at how the wind is moving the, um, the covering, not the covering, I'm sorry. <laughs> the, I cannot think of this, what it is called right now. I'm just going to call it the webbing on the door for safety. Um, I'm sure there's a proper technical term for it, but it's slipping my mind once again. So that's unfortunate. But look at the the wind is moving that. Now talk about attention to detail. That's super cool. I am absolutely digging that and loving that. That's happening right now. That is so cool. Let's see, Dip. Well. I didn't miss the braking zone this time, I just broke way too early and came in way too slow. So, like I said, first time playing, obviously still getting used to the game, um, but clearly my pace is pretty good for these other drivers, I'm, I'm still managing to stay in first place. But the sounds are, are great, and the graphics are good. And so far, I'm having a lot of fun. I like that the driver in the game actually his hand goes and shifts that's that's pretty cool that's a nice little feature I'm using paddle shifters um, but obviously this car is not equipped with paddle shifters well it looks like for our first race we are gonna take first place so that's awesome great way to start your career Oh, confetti. All right, first place. First race, first place. I'm thrilled. Oh, and did you just notice that the front of the car had some paint missing from when we scrapped early on with that Audi? That's really cool. Here's a black loading screen, but that was a lot faster. Alright, so it does look that the points that you get and you accumulate in the race do help you to level up. As you can see, we went from level 1 to level 2 and got a whole bunch of awards. That's awesome. That's really cool. Alright, so I had done another race, um, unfortunately I didn't capture on video. During that time, I did change the livery on the Subaru. 
I made it red. So here we go. This is actually the third race um, of the touring circuit. Alright, so it always starts you off the first time is obviously a qualification lap. So this is a qualification lap that will determine where we're placed on the grid for the actual race. So this is my first time around this track. Let's see how we do. Maybe I didn't notice this last race, but the ship lights seem a lot brighter right now, which is awesome, and I love it, but I, I didn't notice that so much last race, so maybe it was just the lighting conditions of the last race, or I just wasn't paying attention enough. I'm not sure. Alright, so we're going to be in pole position again on this race. I gotta say, so far, very pleased with this game. It's a ton of fun, especially if you're an occasional racer and you don't want to play like Need for Speed, but you want something that's not like a Seto Corsa or GT Sport. This is a great game. I would definitely recommend picking up this game. Not gonna go down the whole line again. You already know what it looks like. Oh, he hit me. He definitely hit me. I was not anywhere near him. Well, off track. Now we got to recover. From first to fifth on the first corner. I hope the rest of this race doesn't end up like this. I'm actually looking forward to chasing some cars rather than just, you know, holding the lead. Overtake the Volkswagen. And he hit me! Oh my gosh! Alright, note to self, the other drivers are quite aggressive. That was just poor. I don't know what just happened. Let's see, can we overtake the Ford? Looks like it. I don't know if we'll catch the guy in first. Let's push on to the top spot. Well, I'm definitely not catching him now. So it looks like we're going to take second in this race. Yeah, I love that the car actually gets some physical damage. 
you know, when you do hit other vehicles. So obviously not that many uh, rewards that last uh, race because honestly it wouldn't do that good. It was not the best race. But it wasn't a bad race. And you know what? It was fun. At the end of the day, I'm here to have fun doing something I love, which is racing. And we're heading into the final round now, where it'll all be decided. Final round. Tell me what's going Once again, never around this track. I have no idea what to expect. We're definitely going to have to fix that corner. That was utterly slow. I can assure that we're not lining up in pole position on this one. Eight. All right. Well, it suits the number on my car. So let's go from eighth position. Let's see what we can make happen in this race. Be aware of long loading screens and loading times. But at least you get to view and something. We're heading into the final round now, where it'll all be decided. Kristen? Okay, hold on, sorry. Alright, have a good race. Thank you. I will have a good race. Thank you very much. Oh, or maybe not. Maybe a hard one. Oh, that's awesome. Attention to detail. Look, I hit the barrier. The tires moved. The tires fell onto the car. I'm definitely restarting, but attention to detail. That is awesome. Great work, Codemasters. I love it. Okay, let's go. Well... I'm going to predict something, this race is going to be scrappy, because it's tight, and as I said, scrappy. So this will not be a clean race by any means whatsoever. Okay, that was that was all my bad. <laughs> okay. Well, I was waiting for that last race and it didn't happen, but now it did. So, clearly there are um, exceeding the track limit penalties, and I just got one. Well, the penalty will be later, but it did say exceeding track limits, which I thought was going to happen last race when I was in the sand. Oh, and there it is again. Okay, I definitely need to be more cautious. But that's, that's good to know that at least there's real penalties. Obviously, there's no penalties for hitting other cars, but at least there are penalties for exceeding the track limits, and we'll see if there's anything else that pops up. 
Oh wow, I am... Even if I was in first, I'd probably come in seventh with the amount of penalties that I'm incurring. Right, you're on the final lap. Push to the front. That is the goal. Alright! Yes! I haven't seen that yet. Now we have. The car in front of me went off track, into the dirt, and dirt got kicked up under his tires, and we got to see it. That's awesome. Attention to detail. You will have fun with this game. Alright, let's see what happens with all these penalties. So I came in second, but... Oh no, I came in first. But I got awarded second based on the penalties. That's what it looks like. Falling penalties have been applied. And and it came in second. Okay. That's not as bad as I thought. You are going to enjoy this game. If you like racing games and you want to just have fun with a racing game, this is a game to get. Purchase this game. There's going to be a link in the description below where you can just click on it and buy the game directly from Amazon. So that was the last race of the, the first touring series, I suppose. And we took first place out of the whole series. That's awesome. Well, as you can see here, there is a ton of content for me to go through, a ton of stuff that I want to make videos for you guys. And I hope that you enjoyed this video, this first gameplay. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to this channel. Please comment below on what you want to see next, whether you want me to do a complete touring series. So please like and subscribe and watch this next video. And until next time, stay smiling.